everyone, welcome back to another Cut Above with Chris. Third test lather of a soap or cream. This one is the Art of Shaving shaving cream and it is lemon essential oil. Now this smells amazing, it smells like lemon buttercream. It's really nice, you can see the, cons the consistency of it is very very soft, very soft. So what I've done, it's almost like a whipped mousse, it's like a lemon mousse really. Just put a good bit in there, not even a good bit, just a little scoot of my finger. Scent strength out of the tub is probably around about a, I don't know, maybe a sort of three and a half maybe. It's not a super strong scent. The brush again is going to be the Leo Frio Red Dirt Shaving Society. Just flipped out most of the water because this is quite... I did notice when I put it on my finger it's very, very slick. So. This can be either straight on your face or you can use a brush. So I'll just let's just see what we can do with it. The scent's coming out of the bowl already. Very nice. So as you can see, very very dry. So let's give that a good dip. I've heard good things about it. I've watched Stephen the Suffolk shaver. I'm pretty sure he used it not too long ago. Not this scent, but the art of shaving shaving cream and he really enjoyed it from memory I do remember watching it sort of my memory's not what it used to be and when you watch so many different YouTube channels it lathers really well As you can see it's just starting to build now, so I'm just going to dip the tips again. See if I can get a good voluminous lather. Yeah, scent's lovely. It's not it's lemon essential oil, but it's something else going on in there. I'm not sure what it is. Like I say, it smells more like a lemon cream, it's got a bit of sort of dairy scent to it, a creamy scent. I know it is a cream. It actually smells like a cream that you would put in a cake. Yeah, very impressive. Starting to really grow now. As you can see, this peak's poking right at the top of there. Peak's all in here. Let's just dip the tips again and just see if we add a little bit more water, what we'll get. I haven't had a bad thing out of this box yet that you sent me, Kenny. So, long may it continue. I'm loving the scent on this though. This is lathering like a beast, this stuff. It really is. I'm really impressed with this. Right, I'm going to see if I can scoop it all out. So that's pretty much the bowl's pretty much empty now. And as you can see, that is absolutely cake. Smells lovely. As you can see, there's just loads there. Absolutely loads. There's a few little layer bubbles in it, but it's nothing major at all. It's, and as you can see, it's just superb. Slickness. Slickness is great. Okay, slickness feels really good. It would obviously cheat, it might change a little bit when it's on your face, you do notice. Oh, it's a nice scent though, as it's going down the drain. Right, that's another test lather done. Art of shaving. Essential lime, lime essential oil was it? Lime. Lime and essential oil. Brush or brushless. Lovely. So it's made in London, the UK, and this was imported by Procter and Gamble to Toronto. Yeah, Art of shaving. Very nice, really nice stuff, quite impressed. Obviously, we won't really know how good it is to we shave with it, but let's see how we go. Thanks very much for tuning in. Stay safe, drive safe, don't drink and drive, and I'll catch you guys next time. Cheers.